What is up, YouTube? My G Men won today. Everybody up on YouTube now is being like, You motherfuckers only beat the 49ers by three points. If Romo and Dez were an L, you guys wouldn't be leading the division. But the fact is, first off, we got John Beeson out. We had Cromartie out before. We got Victor Cruz out. He hasn't come back yet. Odell Beckham Jr. got hurt, so we don't know how he's going to do now. But you know what, though? Well, he came back in the game, so we know he's all right. But, but you know what, though? Everyone's like, well... We we didn't have Des Bryant and Tony Romo as I'm talking about cowboy fans as you can see. First off, when you guys beat us in week one, you guys know. I mean you guys earned that victory. But you know, if you want to talk about excuses, you lie throwing that ball out the end zone. You wouldn't have won that game. You know that. But I'm not hey, I'm willing to chalk it up to hey, we you play better than us. But why are you Cowboys fans talking shit? Because you don't lead the division anymore? Is that what it is? You don't lead the division anymore. The Giants do. We lead the division now. And that's the way it's going to stay. That's the way it's going to stay. The Eagles, the Redskins, and the Cowboys all lost today. So that makes all of your records two and three. And ours is three and two. So now we lead the division, okay? Which puts us at a something like a seven hundred or something like that. Around there somewhere. Anyway. But like when your teams beat us, we're not like, well, we didn't have half our team. So Cowboys fans. Shut the fuck up. You lost today. You got fucking handed your asses handed to you by New England. 30 to 6. 30 to 6. That's what happened to you. So don't come on YouTube now. And be like, well, you guys beat the 49ers by three points. You know what You know what we also did? Got a 3-2 and two record. Now, you lead the division in division wins, but that's only until next week, though. Because everybody knows the Eagles ain't going to beat us. Cowboys fans. Shut the fuck up. You don't lead the division anymore. Oh, and Dez and, and Tony come back. And what? Week seven or eight, you're gonna be done by then. You're you're gonna be done by then. Everybody in the division is gonna be so far ahead of you by that point that you're not gonna be able to catch up. You're not gonna catch up. That's not. You're not gonna be able to catch up. You're not catching anybody in this division. Or you you certainly ain't catching us. Maybe you'll catch e, uh, Washington or 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 Philadelphia, but you're not catching New York. Philadelphia ain't gonna beat us next week. And you're losing next week to whoever the fuck you play. Because Brandon Whedon is what now? Five wins and 20 losses as a starting quarterback? For every one win he has as a starting quarterback, he's got three losses behind it. Your season's over. You're fucked. Shut the fuck up. Just be happy that you're not in a worse condition than you are. The Giants lead the division, and that's the way it's staying for the year. Or for the season. Fuck you, Cowboys fans. Later.